How many eighth graders know the difference between a coal and a cliff, between a firth and a fjord? Well, a youngster, youngster from Austin, Texas sure does. He won the National Geographic GOB. As it turns out, this young man is the king of bees. Jan Crawford tells us why. Nihar, what do you have? The Finnmark Plateau. Atreya, what do you have? Our danger veto. The correct answer is... The Finnmark Plateau. Until the last moment, Nahar Jenga felt like the underdog as the final round of the championships went into overtime. The two finalists tied for five rounds in a row. But Jenga had felt this kind of pressure before. May I have the definition? Back in 2016, as a fifth grader, he was the co-champion of the Scripps National Spelling Bee, then the youngest to ever win. In the moment that his focus and hard work paid off for a second time, he was overwhelmed. All the pressure from studying is all over, so. After making the top 10 at last year's Geography B, Jenga's father wanted him to retire and focus on school. So now can you say to your dad, I told you so? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. His mom already told me that. Now Jenga's setting his sights even higher, hoping to compete as a high schooler in the International Brain Bee. A fitting challenge. Do you have any idea what you might want to be when you grow up? A neurosurgeon. Jenga won a $25,000 college scholarship. Geography providing a path for his future. Jan Crawford, CBS News, Washington.